If you miss the classic games of yesteryear where it was all about the fun and gaming was something that the whole family could enjoy, then Carrion is not that game. Well, it is a classic and it is fun to play, and today we're going to play Carrion on Linux, so stand by. Welcome, beautiful and amazing people. My name is Jay, and this is DS Tech Media, where we cover everything tech and media, from coding to gaming, phones to laptops and servers, but specializing in Linux and open source software, and speaking of games. It's been a long time since I did a gaming video, because I haven't yet fixed my gaming rig, and I just haven't had the time. But Carrion's a game that should run on just about any computer, meaning Windows, Mac, and yes, even Linux. It's not graphics intensive, so it should run on nearly any desktop or laptop. It's also available for Microsoft, Xbox, and the Nintendo Switch, so just about everyone can get this game. And despite not being GPU intensive, the art and concept are brilliantly done. Carrion is an indie game from Phobia Game Studio. It's sort of a retro classic horror platformer, but with a bit of a twist. Smaller game studios seem to be putting out a lot of great games now, and games that are fun to play and have their own art and style that's timeless and literally does more with less. I should note that Carrion is rated M for violence, blood, and gore. It costs $19.99 on Steam at full price and it has overwhelmingly positive reviews. Pretty awesome trailer. Okay, so let's go ahead and play the game. So as you've probably already figured out by now, in Carrion, the twist I mentioned earlier is that you play as the villain. And the game's controls are excellent. And I really love the uh, the artwork too. Thank you. 
It is a little graphic though. Everything about this game is top notch. The controls are fluid. Also, the sound design is excellent. Both the sound effects and soundtrack are tight and on point. As you consume humans, the beast, as it's called, becomes larger and eventually gains new abilities. It's like a classic game, but it's it's honestly even better in a lot of ways as well. This is apparently a save point. Also, the uh, load times are very good. And I think the artwork is, is just pretty epic.
you can interact with uh, a lot of the environment. Oh man, I can't believe it, I actually died. There we go. Shoot a cobweb to track E. Okay, so now I got a new uh, skill.
I died again. Well guys, obviously I'm not going to play the entire game, but that's it, that's Carrion. This is a really good game. It's only $20 on Steam for Mac, Linux, and Windows, and of course you can also get it on the Xbox and the Nintendo Switch, and I just thought this would be a good game to show everyone. I was really impressed with it. Um, it's definitely a lot of fun to play. It's pretty addictive. I didn't think I would record playing for that long. But yeah, let me know what you think. Have you played it? And do you think you're going to get it now that you've seen it? If you hadn't heard of it before. I'm going to try and do uh, more gaming content. So let me know what you think about uh, me doing the games on the DS Tech channel. As always, I'll have uh, plenty of new content in the pipeline. I got some new gear, some new hardware, so we're going to be playing around with that. Hoping uh, to build a new gaming computer, and we'll be doing a lot more gaming in the hopefully near future. Uh, as always, I thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. It's a small channel, and I need your support. You can follow me on Mines, Steemit, and Peaked or Hive. And of course, I'm at Twitter as well. And you can find all the links in the description of the video below. I thank you for watching. And until next time, I'll see you in the next one.